Hello, beautiful people of the internet. What's up? It's your girl, Keisha. The best way to save money on your skincare is to make sure that regardless of the price of your product, you are using just the required amount on your skin. It's very often that I see people overuse how much product they need and you're running through a lot of your products quickly. Myself, I'm definitely a victim of this too because I love to indulge in my products, but truthfully, there's only a certain amount of product that you need. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys exactly how much skincare you should be using for each product on your face. If this is your first time seeing my face, my name is Lakeisha and on my channel I post a lot of skincare, makeup, hair, and lifestyle related videos. If that is something you're interested in, then make sure you are subscribed. Without further ado, let's go to my bathroom. So starting off your routine, of course the first is cleanser. For your cleanser, you want to be using about a dime size amount of product. So I'm just with my Youth to the People Kale Green Tea Spinach Vitamins Superfood and about a dime size looks like that. Now there's many different ways to put it on your face. Some people just do this and put it on their face, but I actually like to put water onto the cleanser and rub it up in my hands first. The reason being is because it allows the products or the ingredients in the products to activate. So that's when you should put it on. It's okay if you don't have like a scent to your product and it's just simply like a milky cleanser or a creamy cleanser, but the point is to let the ingredients activate. There you go. And of course you want to cleanse your skin for 60 seconds. Next is your toners. When it comes to toners, there's about three general types that you can find. There are hydrating toners that come in either a bottle or a spray, and of course there's exfoliating toners. So you want to differentiate between all three of them. Generally, you want to be using a quarter sized amount of toner on your skin, regardless of which type. And I believe that, about a quarter sized amount, and put that on your face. And then what I'm using is the Wonder Black Rice Hyaluronic Toner that you guys have seen me use forever. Mmm, so refreshing. <laughs> Next is your serums. Serums, they definitely come in various forms, whether it be really liquidy serums, whether it be gel type serums, or lotion type serums. But generally, the rule of thumb is you want to apply about a blueberry size of your serum on your face. I mean, we've all seen those videos where people drip serums all running down their face, but that is just not necessary. And especially when they're active ingredients, you don't want to be using that much. Um, so I'm currently using Faded uh, by Topicals. So I'm going to get a blueberry size on the ball of my finger and put that on my face. Next is your moisturizer. Where your moisturizers are concerned, you want to be using about a nickel size amount for your face and neck. I'm using the Purito B5 Panthenol Rebarrier Cream, and so I'm going to put this on my hand. Last but not least, we have our sunscreen. Now, I personally can talk about sunscreen for days. In my personal opinion, it is just about the most important product in your skincare routine. I actually dedicated a whole series to reviewing them. You wanna be using about a half a teaspoon for both your face and neck, or to simplify it, about two finger lengths worth of product. And what's cool about this is that you can break it up into fours. So you take the first part of it and you put that here, the second part, you put that here, next part, put that here, and use this on your neck. And that is your even four. Go ahead and massage it into your skin. Now 
And of course, do not forget your ears or your neck. And for your sunscreen specifically, you want to make sure that you reapply. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Comment down below and let me know what are your tips for measuring how much product you need. I would love to hear your thoughts. Go ahead and click over here to see some of my previous videos. And I'll see you lovely ladies and gents in my next one. Bye.